Hello, and welcome to my review of the Ollie by Sphero. Let's get to it. For those who don't know, Ollie is a fast robot made by a company called Sphero. Ollie was predicted to be the big brother of the Sphero, and well, yes, it's bigger, and in most cases, better. The Ollie can reach up to speeds of 14 miles per hour. Now that's great. If I'm riding my penny bud down the street and going out for an hour, but if I'm in a small area like in my room, speed isn't what I want. Now you can tweak this in the settings and stuff, but when you take away the speed from Ollie, there isn't much left. No missions to complete, no cores to earn, no tricks to buy, and no extra games to play. Now this isn't a hardware issue, no. All we need is a team of app developers to come together and make a few apps. When we jump onto the App Store, we see at least 10 apps for the Sphero 2.0 for us to go and download. Unfortunately with Ollie, we just don't have that availability yet. Yet is a strong keyword in this sense, as the Ollie hasn't been out as long as Sphero, but I believe there should be at least one more app out there for Ollie. Another good thing from Ollie that I didn't actually know about until last Sunday was that Ollie works with Macrolab. Again, for those who don't know, Macrolab is a programming app for kids to go on to learn basic program skills and how Sphero works. I'm glad that Ollie can work with this app as the programs that I built in fit Ollie perfectly. Also, I like how when you close the Ollie app, Ollie automatically turns off. Now this is great at the moment, but as soon as the new apps come out, this may start to be a huge problem. As I don't want to have to wait for Ollie to connect every time I want to try out a new code or play a quick game of Sphero Tag or Color Grab. The only major downside of Ollie has to be its lack of waterproof capabilities. As Ollie going at 40 miles per hour in water would be brilliant. But due to the USB charger, this is impossible. To be honest, I actually prefer the wireless charger for Sphero 2.0. So if Sphero could make a USB wireless charging dock for Ollie, I could forgive them for their lacking apps. Anyway, that is it for this review. Overall, Ollie is great for those who love speed, drifting, and staying out of water. But for those who love games, missions, and water, I'd recommend this for 2.0. I will be talking about this sort of thing in my comparison video later this week. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.